Okay, so in this video we're going to be looking at the Estate Series. Estate Series is a six-week kit. It's a premium six-week kit with 10 liters of concentrate. Uh, the differences between, let's just go from, uh, so we have the four-week kit, which is on the house. That's a six-liter kit. Then we have Original Series, which is an eight-liter kit. And now we have the Estate Series, which is a 10-liter kit, six weeks. Uh, the other thing is, is that between the Original Series and the Estate Series, we both have point of origin in that one. So in this one, you can see uh, the unboxing we're doing right now, it's a Pinot Grigio Italian, so it's an Italian Pinot Grigio, versus, uh, as well as in the eight and the original series, it's a point of origin. On the house isn't point of origin. So those are sort of the, the differences between that. And then we have, uh, so we have, uh, again, uh, a 10 liter kit, so I'm gonna open it up. Again, I can use my, my elbow, find it a little easier to break up the box. We have our ad pack. And we have our kit, so our concentrate kit. What I always recommend to do is we always, I always try and keep these uh, these stickers that are easily peeled too. They come up pretty easily, <laughs> and that way you have tracking of what you made if you really liked it, or if you have any issues, which is very rare. But if you do, you can track it as well. <laughs> in this video, in this. Uh, bladder you can see if you look at it there's a little bit of sediment I actually try and put that in there so I just mix it up a bit and that way I make sure that everything's sort of in there and even though it's 10 liters it's gonna be hev heavier than 10 kilograms just be aware of that because it is concentrate uh, so it is a bit heavier and the best way of handling it is I usually if the bucket is here for example I would uh, pick it up like this so I would put a uh, wide part, or sorry, uh, like uh, this part forward, and then the closer part I would hold it like this, and then this just pops off usually with your hand, or if you need to, uh, you can use a can opener or, or a bottle opener sort of style. We also sell something that does open it, it's called a cap opener, um, if it's easier for you as well. Now you just pour it in, and that way you're able to control it a little bit more. You can use the box if you'd like. So there is an option to put the but the put the bag in the box and have it so that it's uh, that it pours through the box. I've actually never done it this way, um, just because a I'm already screwing this up, and uh, secondly, um, I just find that it's it doesn't I can't it, it might work for people that are maybe have difficulty with the weight, but for me. Um, I find that just having it on a flat surface that I'm not holding and then just nudging it forward and then pouring it is a lot easier. This is a little bit heavier than, you know, the on the house four week or or the, the original series, but just be aware as long as you have like something to put it on and something to pour it off of, it, it, it is a little bit easier. Okay, and the ad pack is just like the rest of them, most of, uh, most of the four week kits. There's a little bit of, an, there's a bit more, I think, of the bentonite. Um, so we'll go by order. So the first thing you'd put in is the EC118 yeast. Um, the dates are, are usually, the expiry dates are really, really good on these. So we go through kits pretty quickly. So you usually have about a two year expiration date on them. And that's the first thing that would probably, um, in my opinion, you know, go stale. The concentrate is um, sealed properly, so it, it can last quite some time. We have a bentonite, there's about 30 grams in the premium kit, and uh, that just helps for clarification, and those are put in at the same time as the yeast. And then we have uh, the sulfite sorbate mix. Uh, again, it's 9.5 grams of the two combinations, and uh, you put this in when you're um, transferred it and you're letting it clear, clear out. And then we have our kizosol and chitosan. So kizosol would go in first, and then chitosan would go in next, and this just helps clarificate clarification uh, during the 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 last phase of uh, the winemaking. Just be aware that there is uh, sulfite, uh, sorry, um, crustaceans in this. So if you're allergic to any um, crustaceans, then um, you can't put that in. And then we have our instruction sheets. Um, just follow the instruction sheets. It's pretty pretty simple. Uh, it's it's uh, it's pretty easy. Um, the only thing that this doesn't come with are corks, sterilizer, and if you want labels and, and things like that. 
which we also uh, sell. So, so that's, that's sort of it when it comes to the six week kit. They're really, really good. I like that they're point of origin. That's, that's pretty cool. And they make uh, 23 liters. Their final product when you add the water is 23 liters, which is six gallons or uh, 30 bottles at 750 mils.